that's moving. It's getting up. Body uphill, the darker one. Where you want 300, send it. Hurry. No, no, no. seconds. <laughs> <laughs>Hi, I'm Guy Eastman, and this is Eastman's Hunting TV. On today's episode, we're going to one of our favorite spots, Eastern Montana, after big mule deer bucks. This week, we're going to be hunting with our EHJ hunt winner. As usual, each year we take a hunt winner from our EHJ subscriber base, but this year we have a bonus hunt winner from our Tag Hub format. That's our digital MRS online. So the Tag Hub hunt winner's from Idaho, and he's from northern Idaho, so he's used to hunting whitetail, and this is gonna be one of his first mule deer hunts. Our EHJ hunt winner is from California, so this is all new to him. This country in eastern Montana, it's wide open, and there's been a drought, so the antler growth could be a little low this year. But usually on a drought year, if Rod and I dig around hard enough, we can usually find a couple good bucks. So let's not waste any time. Let's get out there with our Eastman's hunt winners and look for some big pre-rut mule deer bucks in big sky country. Relax, he's gonna be there a bit. 
Welcome back. We're hunting Montana mule deer with our 2021 hunt winners. We're all set up and ready and waiting for a bedded buck to stand. Head's moving. Head's moving. He's getting up. See him now? He's at 300. Just this side. He's gonna come out by this knob over here. He's gonna be about 428, 430. If he comes up out right there, he'll come out. You don't have a shot right now. And there's some sage this side of him. He's moving now. Now he's out of sight. Now he can you see him? Head down. He's doing face on. No, he's laying down. You don't have a shot. Guy Eastman here. I'm behind the camera this week with our 2021 mule deer hunt winners. We're in Montana and we're using the weather to our advantage. We got one spotted. As long as this, I said we got one spotted, so as long as this fog doesn't set in. The wind's good. There's a lot of ice, but I think if we can ease up that hill, we can make this deal. Steve, he's 3.30. Go ahead and drop that in there. Let's wait for him to turn broadside. Okay, he's walking. Okay, he stopped. Go ahead. Hit him, reload, reload. Yeah, he's humped up. You just stay on him. No, he's down. He's down. We're here with Steve Vorman from Chino, California, and he is the 2021 Eastman's Hunting Journal hunt winner. Yep, way to hold your composure and good shot. Thank you. Thank yep. You, All right. All right, let's get up there and take a look at him. Hi, 
deer, Steve. Nice Montana mule deer. Uh, nice deep forks, long main beam, got some age on him. Made a great shot in uh, not so great conditions, but uh, no, that was good. We got a good set up there and got you over your pack and it was worked out great. Well, congratulations, Steve and Rod. Uh, got it done. I was on the camera, but that was uh, definitely not an easy shot. <laughs> <laughs> you get the, I think, the award for the toughest shot the hunters had to make. 320 yards across this wind howling saddle here, and we got a, about a foot of drift or, or more on that bullet. Yep. But I'm luckily thrilled. the buck was facing the right way. So Steve is our 2021 Eastman Hunting Journal Hunt winner. Just love, love being out here. And we actually have two hunt winners this year, so we have Mitch yet to fill. <laughs>
a little bit of everything in there to get you going on the hunt. And uh, some of the stuff paid off on this one. We'll uh, definitely use the Outdoor Edge knife here in just a second. Yep, that'll be there. Got that in my pocket right yeah, now. <laughs> there you go. Ready to go with it. Yep, yep. We hope you enjoyed today's show. We had a great time out here with our two hunt winners, Mitch and Steve, from Eastman's Hunting Journal and Tag Hub on some big trophy bucks with Rod Paskey at Sizzling S Outfitters. Another great year in the books. We'll see you next week right here on Eastman's Hunting TV. Remember, trophy hunting is conservation. Tags and bags.